Let's bring in a reporter who was actually inside the courtroom when the judge handed down Cosby's sentence of at least three years behind bars. He is Bobby Allen. He covers criminal justice for WHYY News. Bobby, I was reading your tweets as you were sending him out of the, of the, of the courtroom there. Give us an idea of the mood and Bill Cosby's demeanor when, when the judge was just getting... Oh, I'm sorry, we got Bill Cosby walking out. Right now, uh, where's that camera? There he is. So Bill Cosby, hold on a second, if you will, Bobby. We've got Bill Cosby now walking out. You heard earlier his spokespeople say that Bill Cosby was doing fine, that Bill Cosby was wrongly convicted. They're, of course, you know, setting up the appeal here. Bill Cosby is now being placed into a vehicle. He'll be taken directly to Montgomery County Jail where he'll be processed. The process of how long it takes to actually go from the jail to the prison, I'm unclear. I don't know, maybe you know this, is it, is it a... It's a process. They have to process him, get his fingerprints, get mm -hmm. him all checked out medically as well. I think it was interesting that we heard that in prison they might assign him an inmate that will assist him because he is blind, because he is in poor health. I think that will be an interesting thing to see. Yeah, so Bill Cosby is now in the car. He will be taken to Montgomery County Jail. Uh, I want to bring Bobby Allen back in. As he said, he covers uh, criminal justice for WHYY News. Uh, Bill Cosby is now kind of moving. And, and Bobby, I want to get your feel of what he was like and, and what the mood was like in the courtroom right before the judge uh, gave the sentence. So the judge gave away pretty quickly that he was going to get a state sentence. He said, you know, Cosby's defense team pushed for probation. I don't think that's appropriate, the judge said. You know, the, the Cosby defense team pushed for an intermediate county sentence. I don't think that's appropriate. I think total confinement is appropriate. And that sounds kind of wonky to a general audience, but I cover criminal justice in Pennsylvania, and I knew right away that meant he's getting a state sentence. In the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, that means at least two years. And indeed, when Judge O'Neill said he's getting between three to ten Ten years, that wasn't a surprise to me, but it was a surprise to many people because they were thinking, what is the sentence? What is he saying? It was a very long-winded statement from Judge O'Neill from the bench, but the whole time Cosby's just looking down, leaning back in his chair, not having much of a reaction. I turned around to look at, there was a row of accusers, about half a dozen of them, and they too, stony-faced, looking straight ahead. It was remarkable how quiet the courtroom was. I mean, really, really, really quiet, and that just added to the intense suspense. 